Happy New Year for the ones I haven't spoke to this year. It is another year, 2024. Maybe this year be good to us. But to me anyway. Well, last year was good. Didn't have, didn't lose anybody in my family last year close. But I'm out here now in our garden. And it is time to cauliflower. Yes. There's number one cauliflower need picking. And it is big. And look how big it is. With my hand. Cauliflower number two need picking. Big and pretty for the worms find out this free food. Cauliflower number three knee picking. For the worms find out that this a cauliflower is ready. Cauliflower number four is coming along. That could stay a little longer than the last three. And we got a bunch of broccoli knee picking. It's good to have come out. Could just come outside and walk in your garden and pick stuff. So we got broccoli knee picking. Look at that. And some little ones just coming. Look at that. Another big head knee picking. Another one here down there knee picking. Some more broccoli knee picking. That one knee picking. That one need picking. That one need picking. Nothing like raising your own food as much as you can, and that's what we do every season. That one could stay a little longer. These could stay a little longer, a little broccoli. And this is about the fourth or fifth time picking off these. Just a lot of little ones coming in down there, so they can stay a while. Cold weather's not gonna hurt them, it's gonna help them. Some more broccoli knee picking. Some more. That's enough to get here. Probably get that one day this week, too. Over here, there's some more. There's a lot down in there. All up under there is broccoli. And we got some cabbage that needs picking. And the collards need picking. These, I think these is Georgia collars, maybe. I know we got some um, cabbage collars. These needs picking because the center is saying, pick me, pick me. So that needs picking. All these are here. I'll probably put all these in the freezer this week. If I can find some room. Yeah, this is the cabbage collars because it's got a head in it like a cabbage. Like this is a cabbage collar too because it's got a head in it. That's the way I can tell you. <sighs> yep, all these collards need picking and freezing. Come out, get the what's need picking. That's a pretty, uh, I guess this, this is a cabbage collard too. That's pretty big. Y'all look, look how big that thing is. Another uh, cabbage collard. See the head in there? That's why we call it cabbage collard because it's like a cabbage. Behind me, you got some cabbage knee pick and I'm gonna take them in the house and wrap them up in some the right kind of paper so they keep in the refrigerator all this collars knee picking that cabbage knee picking that cabbage knee picking that cabbage that cabbage knee picking that one that one knee picking all of them knee picking that one that one and I will be getting it because we eat a lot of cabbage in the kale I see some um, spinach want to come up in this stuff. You have to look for the spinach because everything else got it covered. But the um, kale is still doing good. This is the kale when I know it's rough leaves on it like that. So just a whole bit of kale. Then over there is the turnip salad, which the, the tops is no good anymore, but it's got some turnips up on it, so I guess I'll be getting some turnips. But this is what my desk sister is coming out here and 